What's going on guys? How you doing? This is Kendrick the Sports Guy with TFG Sports Media here on YouTube and on Facebook, Kendrick Sports Hustle page. Buckle up fans, the USFL Football League is back and they're holding their draft on Tuesday night. But before we get to some of those details, click like and subscribe to TFG Sports Media right here on YouTube. Flip over to Facebook, click that thumbs up button for Kendrick Sports Hustle page. USFL football is back and the first game will be kicking off on April the 16th at 6.30 p.m. Central Time. And the first game of the season will feature the Birmingham Stallions and the New Jersey Generals from Protective Stadium in Birmingham. But before we get to that, got to talk about the draft lottery. That starts tomorrow night on Tuesday night at 6.30 p.m. Uh, the Michigan Panthers hold the first overall pick, followed by Tampa Bay Bandits. Philadelphia Stars, New Jersey Generals, the Houston Gamblers, Birmingham Stallions, Pittsburgh Maulers, and the New Orleans Breakers. Again, the uh, first draft, that starts tomorrow night, Tuesday night, and it's not televised. So you kind of have to go on uh, the website and follow that. It won't be televised. So that's the unfortunate thing. And it will continue as well on Wednesday morning. So it's a two-day draft process. Now, you're probably wondering, how many rounds? It's a total of 35 rounds all together. 35 rounds. Uh, on day one of the draft, there will be 12 rounds, and each team will make a selection on day two. The teams will go through rounds 13 through 35. Now, teams will only have two minutes to make a selection on day one, 90 seconds for rounds 13 to 23 on day two, and only one minute for rounds 24 through 35. Now, the players, you probably wonder where they're coming from. The USFL's eight teams will have a player pool of around 500 athletes who have signed contracts with the league. Only players who sign contracts will be eligible to play this season. So who signed these contracts? Do we know any of them? Well, the USFL hasn't disclosed yet any of those names. It appears that the league will be waiting for the players to actually be selected as a surprise to the public. The only stipulation in joining the league, you must have graduated high school by 2020. Former NFL players, college student athletes, and former high school and semi pro stars are expected to participate. Now again, the rosters are only 38 players, and they also have a seven-man practice squad. So again, the USFL is back with eight teams. The draft starts tomorrow, and the season kicks off April the 16th in Birmingham. All the 10 home games, all the home games going to be played in Birmingham. So I want to know what you guys think. You're going to check it out? You think it'll survive this time? All the games will be shown on Fox, so they got a little bit more financial backing behind them. So I want to know what you guys think. Leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. This has been your sports guy, Kendrick, with a TFG Sports Media Report. And until next time, peace.